Hello Derek. Hi Kenny. So what's on the agenda today? Today we're going to be playing When Irish Eyes Are Smiling. Oh gorgeous tune, brilliant. Written by Chauncey Alcott and Jack Wee. Jeffrey Graff, I do Right, think. okay. Yeah, yeah, a long time ago. Uh -huh. But I think it was um, it was composed by Ernest Ball mm -hmm. around about 1912. Right. For a, I think it was a production of Isle of Dreams. Ah, oh, right. Uh, at that yeah. time. Ah, yeah. right. And I do know that John McCormack, that famous Irish tenor. Oh, right, yeah. He, he recorded that during the First World War. He did. Yes, yeah. I understand that. Mm -hmm. yeah, all lovely tune, but uh, well, over a hundred year old now. Yeah. But yeah, still to this day. What do you call an Irishman trying to break up a fight? An Irishman trying to break up a fight? Liam Malone. Liam <laughs> Malone. <laughs> <laughs> Liam Malone, that's a nice one. <laughs> Paddy told Murphy. His wife was driving him to drink. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Murphy, Murphy said to Luffy Bugger, my next me walk. <laughs> <laughs> and what do, you call, what do you call an Irishman who knows how to control his wife? Who knows how to control mm -hmm. him? Oh, <laughs> no. A murder suspect. <laughs> An American lawyer, he asked Paddy, why is it when you ask an Irishman a question, he answers back with another question. <laughs> Paddy says, who told you that? <laughs> <laughs> My missus a while back said, if we were both lost on a desert island, uh -huh. who would you like most to be there? I said, on a desert island. On a desert island. Oh wow! Yeah. Uh -huh. I said, me Uncle Billy. Uncle Billy yeah, yeah, on a desert said, island. Yeah. yeah uh -huh. And I said, she says, well, what's so special about him? I said, he's got a boat. <laughs> 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 ah, why are there only a few Irish lawyers in London? I don't know. Because only a few pass the bar. <laughs> Anywhere when Irish eyes are smiling. Go okay. Care. Lovely too. Top of the morning to you, Big Orange.